Hey guys, welcome to my new video. Today I want to share with you the process of creating a sticker sheet for a cafe or a coffee shop. So actually I'm working on my portfolio and I decided to share the things that I'm working on with you. It's an imaginary project that I made up. Uh, so I just decided to do what I like doing, so sketching some cute items for a coffee shop and this idea came up. So in this case it's my imaginary project about a space coffee shop. So it will be like uh, all things space and coffee. Uh, well, so here you can see that I'm roughly sketching some items that I want to include. I, For now I'm sketching a lot of things but later I'm gonna remove some of them. So at this stage the idea is to just get the basic shapes in so that you have something to work off later. I had created a Pinterest board before, as you might have noticed, so there I already collected some items that I want to include. So at this stage don't worry about being precise, just put down the basic shapes, it will help you a lot later. Every hour we spend together And suddenly The chances are small just like the lottery I also want to include an imaginary coffee shop to this sticker pack uh, and I'll probably make a, a postcard out of it so it will be like a postcard and a sticker pack. I think that's kind of my dream project, so that's why I decided to make it. You know what they say about the portfolio, that you should include the projects that you want to work with. So for me, it's something cozy, connected with coffee shops and yeah, warm things like that. So I put down these basic shapes and arranged them a little bit. Uh, so now I'm gonna refine the sketches. At this stage you can already put down more details, but still it will not be the final stage. So I will create another line art on top. But the chances are small just like the lottery. At this stage I use Liquify and Transform tool a lot because they help to make the shapes more interesting or just to fix the crooked shapes.
So that's approximately how I want to arrange the objects on the sticker sheet, but I can change it later anyway. And the last stage is to create a cleaner line art. Actually, this is already good enough. I just like to be like super precise, so I create another uh, cleaner line art on top.
So yeah, that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. So later I'm just gonna color them and put it them in my portfolio. That's it. Thank you guys and see you in the next video. But now you tried so hard